Mako's definitely more attracted to being around Gizmo. Normal cat that likes their distance from dogs, but um, he's usually in the highest parts of the house, so that's why Mako will jump on the fridge because he also wants to be at the same level of where Pecan is on a different cabinet. We adopted him in 2018, right around Christmas. Oh, their dog had passed away, so we'd been kind of looking around for a while, and we just went to one of the dog rescue centers. He was kind of sitting there with his back turned towards us, um, and then he turned around and gave us like that little puppy dog look. It's just like we fell in love with him instantly. So he, he was already jumping on counters when we first got him. So we were like, oh, he just has a lot of her energy. Uh, we'll have to kind of train him and be like, oh, okay, don't jump up here, it's okay. But then once we brought the cats out, we started noticing that he just wanted to be around Gizmo all the time. He'd see Gizmo on a counter, he'd leave the counter he was on, jump over next to him. Um, he always wanted to come over and try and snuggle or lick Gizmo. So they've definitely, they're a lot closer than our other cat. So he'll hang out with me, he's very affectionate, but like if the cat comes out of the bedroom, he'll immediately run over to try and play or go around them. Uh, we take him to dog parks, but he's really not that interested in interacting with the other dogs. He'll play kind of fetch with us, but he doesn't really want to be around the dogs as much. Mako's really good with cats. Uh, we got like a little harness for my cat so we can walk him around the backyard with Mako so that they're together outside because our cats are indoor, but we wanted them to kind of have that outdoor space with Mako.